Hi everybody, this is Stephen Brook and welcome to my YouTube channel on architectural photography and composition. We are photographers, not painters. That means if we want the shadows to be perfect, if we want to show volumetric relationships perfectly, we have to be there at exactly the right time. And in many instances, five minutes either way can make a difference between an okay photo and an absolutely spectacular, perfect photo. So let's look at this streetscape in Rome. This was taken at 5.30 in the morning. And there are so many elements which five minutes ago weren't right and about five, ten minutes after this shot was taken, also they're not right. This, taking this picture required really precise timing. Let me show you why. First of all, the sun is coming from this direction. It's coming from the left, coming from the east. These buildings are blocking the sun from getting in my lens, so I don't have any flare. Now, here, the north elevation, which is the main elevation I want to shoot, that's in full sun. So it's clear I'm emphasizing this elevation. Now, number three, and this is really important, earlier, the shadows from this building are on my facade. Here, at about 5.30, they've come off the building. Here they are here. So they're not really obtrusive, but they also give some variety to the light and dark areas in the street. So it's not all in shadow, and it's not all in sun. Number four, the west elevations here, they're in shadow, and they allow me to have a tremendous amount of articulation on the building. So the north and west are in our light and dark, light and dark, light and dark, which gives these buildings a tremendous sense of volume. Now, here is a full height vertical. This is a, called repoussoir in French, and it's something we're gonna talk about in a later episode. But it's a full height vertical, which balances the extreme proportion, the extreme perspective of this particular angle. So if this weren't here, your eye would simply run off the page. But this big vertical in shadow combined with the street in shadow frames my buildings and frames my streetscapes. And notice there are no cars in the foreground. Now in about 10 or 15 minutes, this is a dangerous shot to take in Rome, but the sun will have come around, it would be in the lens, and this shot would have been not nearly as good as it is. So when you look at it, you say, wow, this really looks nice. What went into it? What went into it was very precise timing, down to the minute to be able to get all of these elements working together to get a successful streetscape.